Hello everyone, Josh from Poles and Pipes. Now I'm going to show you how you can pat test a surge protected extension lead and a standard extension lead like one of these. Now it's quite a simple job to do. Um, we're just going to carry out the test now. So let's plug the extension lead into the tester. Plug our IEC test lead in to the socket of the extension and then we're going to carry out the test. Now I'm doing the surge protected extension lead so what we're going to do we're going to do the 250 volt press 500 volt to the 250 volt test button and then power cord test. Now we've got 23 milliohms of earth continuity insulation resistance at 20 mega ohms and the wiring has passed now with surge protected extension leads like i said you need to test it at 250 volts otherwise the surge protection will trip and it will cause a lower reading of insulation resistance now let's do the standard one So I've got it all plugged in here and we're now going to carry out the test. So we've got 21 milliohms of earth continuity, 20 mega ohms of insulation resistance and the wiring has passed. Now bear in mind that when you're testing extension leads you need to test each and every socket in case of a poor earth connection. The reason why is that is because um, you've got uh, a earth on each one and if the reading is higher you need to log that. It's very important. Thank you very much.